Grab your gadgets and synchronize your watches. We're going on a word heist. The goal of word heist is to earn the highest score by spelling words using letters that are laid out in the center of the table. You earn points by signaling to your opponents which letters you've used in your word without them guessing what your word is. If you want to learn how to set up Word Heist, check out our video here. Once you're ready, each player spells a word using only the letters laid out on the table and writes that word on the top half of their player board. You can use letters multiple times, however you can't spell a word that's already been used in a previous round. Once everyone has written down their words, it's time to drop clues. Players take turns putting their pieces on some of the letters that they have used in spelling their word. You must drop between one and five clues. And the more clues you give, the more points you get, but the easier it is for your opponents to guess what your word is. Also, if you've used a letter multiple times, you must put exactly that many clues on that letter. Now, players get to analyze the clues on the board and take a guess at what one of their opponent's words is. And you would write that guess on the bottom half of your player board. Finally, let's reveal and score. Go around the table and say what your heist word is. If anyone else guessed what your word is, they cry halt, and they're gonna end up scoring the points that you would have scored for your word. If no one guesses your word, you're in the clear. That's a successful word heist, and you're gonna score points for it. Words are worth one point for every clue token on them. You also earn extra points if you used the showcase letters or met the conditions of the bonus vault cards. Also, if you halted someone else, you score the points they would have scored for their word. And that's all there is to a round of word heist. Now that everyone's scored, let's go ahead and set up for the next round. Add everyone's words to the word gallery so that we remember which words have already been used. Shuffle up the letters again and play the same letters down in a new order. Replace the bonus vault cards with two new ones. Erase everyone's player boards and return their tokens to them. Now you're ready for another round of Word Heist. Play for three rounds, and at the end of three rounds, the person with the most points wins. But remember, that third round is a high stakes heist. And that means that words in the third and final round are worth double points. Now, just so everyone's on the same page, there's a few restrictions on which words you can and can't use. You can't use proper nouns like a specific place or a person's name. You can't reuse words or related words like shell and shells. And misspelled words or words with letters with the incorrect number of clue tokens on them are invalid and score no points. And that's it. Check back in with Fair Game for more great videos and good luck on your word heist.